Throughout the history of aviation, there have been many firsts. Each one has been unique and contains stories spoken in many voices. One such event was the first non-stop transpolar flight from Moscow in the then Soviet Union to Vancouver, Washington, 75 years ago. Pearson Airfield, near the banks of the Columbia River, appeared as the best choice for the Russian crew as they feared that landing at the airport in Portland would have devastating consequences. Having knowledge of what happened to the spirit of St. Louis when Charles Lindbergh landed in France, they did not want their aircraft to be dismantled for souvenirs. So they landed safely in Vancouver. The crew of three flying their single engine airplane endured more than 63 hours of flight, many of them over the Arctic Ocean, the North Pole. The documentary film, Handshake Over the Pole, airing on Clark Vancouver Television Channel 23, as well as online at www.cvtv.org, has historic footage of the ANT-25 airplane and the details of this aviation first. Upon hearing of the landing at Pearson Field, General George C. Marshall drove across the polo field to greet the Russian flyers. He then hosted a breakfast for them in their honor. In 1975, the city of Vancouver invited the surviving crew members and the son of the main pilot to a ceremony for the unveiling of a monument dedicated to them and their historical journey. The flight's 38th anniversary was held with much fanfare and news coverage. This year is the 75th anniversary and was celebrated in June with the laying of flowers at the monument and a celebratory breakfast. The monument is located at Pearson Field. For more information, playback times, or video on demand, visit us online at www.cvtv.org.